people can read your video if they can't hear it. So in this example, I have a Facebook post that's going up for a client and you can see here that you can, he, he's gonna be speaking in the video like this. This is a great customer's uh, process. Really excited to see. There's no overlays. What you can do is you can turn on the captions here and it'll, it'll automatically auto-generate them. And it has to do it. And then once it's posted, you'll see them in the video, which we can check further on in this video. Now there are settings that you can go into, which you can upload a caption file, a .srt, that you can easily create in Adobe Premiere that will go time code and what he's saying at specific times so you can actually edit the text instead of letting Facebook to auto-generate where there might be typos and whatnot. Let's go see the video. You can see that as the person is talking, there is auto-generated by Facebook a closed captions of text overlay so people can read when the audio is off. When the audio goes on, it will disappear. And as you can see, there's certain typos and grammatical errors in it. So that's auto-generated. If you want to actually have it so that it is bulletproof and uh, grammatically correct, you'll want to create an SRT file. Let's show you how to do that over in Adobe Premiere because there's a lot of things that there where you have to pay for transcription services, but you can use your Adobe program, the video editing program, to actually create it for free. In Premiere, it's this easy to create captions from a transcript. Click the Create Captions from Transcript, select an, uh, a speakers, don't separate them, go transcribe, choose Transcribe, and it'll auto-transcribe the whole video for you now you have the opportunity to edit. This is a great customer's uh, pool deck here from uh, start to finish. Uh, see, you can immediately say pool deck here and you edit it. And once you're happy with it, you just go here, you go export SRT. Boom, bada, bing. That, it's that easy to create an SRT file with Premiere that you can use in YouTube and Facebook. Now in YouTube, you can also add overlays for subtitles here. First off, you have to set the language. We're Canada, so let's do that. Now, let's go into subtitles here on the right side inside the video, and you can choose to upload a file, which is an SRT uh, file. You can auto sync it or type it manually along the video right within YouTube. So it's a totally different way, but I would recommend just uploading an SRT file that you create in Premiere, just like you uploaded it in Facebook. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Please like or subscribe, and I'll see you in another video.